robber walks into this local Dollar General showing a gun, a knife, and demanding cash. Eagle eyed off duty police officers spotted him a short time later. Happened shortly after 8 this morning, and we just got an update from police within the past 30 minutes. It happened at the Dollar General on New Kings Road, just outside 295. News for Jack's reporter Bree Isom joins us live. And Bree, that off duty officer chased the suspect until he lost sight of him in the woods. That's right. So he left this Dollar General on his bicycle and he rode north on New Kings Road. You could see New Kings Road right behind us. And that's when an off-duty officer spotted him. He heard that dispatch call, got out of his patrol vehicle and ran after him. Now, JSO says these clerks inside of the store, they're pretty shaken up about the whole situation, but they're glad that JSO finally got him. Now, JSO says this call came out and they responded at about 817 this morning. The clerk says the suspect had a knife and gun and demanded the money. JSO says the clerk placed money from the register in Dollar General in a Dollar General bag along with Oreos and a Mountain Dew drink. Now the suspect then took off on that bicycle. We told you the off-duty officer chased him. Moments later, other officers saw the robber walking on another road and took him into custody. Officers then located the items he stole, his mask and his bike that he rode. A canine unit responded and did a search of the wooded area that he ran off to and found the firearm, the knife, a black hooded jacket. And officers are thankful they were able to arrest the suspect quickly without any incident. We're also very thankful that obviously, you know, we didn't have to use force. Um, the suspect was found without the gun or the knife. It was discarded in the woods and he was cooperative, thankfully for him and our officers. I want to especially thank the off-duty officer for his vigilance and dedication to keeping the community safe. Now, that officer that talked during the briefing said even though they got that suspect, they want to hear from anyone that was in the Stellar General or around at that time to know what they heard and what exactly happened. I'm reporting live on the north side, Bree Isom, Channel 4, the local station.